Hello YouTube, so I'm gonna show you how I made my furnace in less than two hours. What I did was get an old gas bottle, take the valve off, uh, fill it with water, purge all the gas out, all the old gas that was left inside the bottle. Left it like that for about 20 minutes. Um, after you empty the water, cut the top off. So, and then here I am I'm drilling the hole for the gas to go in because this is going to be run off um, propane. So I drill the hole at a slight angle just so it gives it um, the gas going in like a like a vortex type thing. So. This pipe was just slightly too big, just uh, about half a mil bigger than the hole that I drilled, so you'll see me bashing it in in a minute. And for the burner, I decided not to make one <clears throat> of my own and just bought one off uh, eBay. A big blowtorch. It was around about £22 free delivery. And that was with the hose as well. I was just checking if the crucible fits. This is a ceramic blanket. Very nasty stuff. I should have had a respirator but I tried not to breathe any of the dust in whatsoever. This was on, e uh, on eBay as well for about £33, I think I got it. I'm just using the top of the bottle, gas bottle, to cut around circle in it so I could lay it on the base of my furnace.
so I tried it and this pipe that I had welded in was too too long so I just cut that down and it seems to be working pretty good to be a good blue flame so we're ready to fire up This was going to be a cast of my nephew's hand, but he wasn't putting his hand in this hand, he kept moving it about, so I just, just on my own, I just wanted to see what it looked like. And all the ceramic, bl ceramic blanket that's in the furnace, I'm going to cover with a thin layer of fire cement. Well, all in all, it came out pretty well. It took me what, mm, well, 30, 35 minutes to melt this aluminium. So I was pretty chuffed with that. Anyway, thanks for watching. Subscribe for more videos. Pretty cool. I got that, and then out of today. And next week, I'm gonna try either some brass or some copper. Let's see if we can get to them temperatures.